So, while again we're winning, what, what, what does that mean to you to, to, to win a, a classic, a British classic? Yeah, it meant quite a lot. It was um, yeah, first race, first win I had in the UK in since 2019, since I was a junior. Cause I've been racing in Spain, so yeah, I was uh, really pleased with that, and just kind of it was just a good confidence boost as well, knowing that I think there was some people who were kind of saying, "Oh, be interested to see how you do in the UK," you know, because it was a bit flatter, race is slightly different, but um, yeah, I knew I could perform it still, well. It was still a, a good feel, yeah, strong exactly. feel. Yeah, yeah, it was. So, um, and to do a one, two, three. Yeah, exactly. It was a really good ride for the team. Uh, yeah, ride from the teamers, and uh, yeah, we all kind of helped each other and getting in different breaks throughout the day. So yeah, I was really pleased, and uh, yeah, quite a few good winners of that race as well. So it was pretty. And a long way from home. As yeah, well. it was quite a long way. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm putting pressure now on the uh, on the likes of the, the Harrys and the, <laughs> and the Matts in the team. Yeah, well, um, <laughs> all you guys are, are rocking up and winning races. Yeah, well, I think that's that's what I think everyone in the team wants. If you do well, you know, it makes other people want to do well as well and kind of prove themselves. And um, yeah, I think we're all here to kind of do the best we can. And we know if we do the best we can, we should be up there, up, well, up there, hopefully competing for the win. And um, yeah, it's about kind of gaining experience from each other as well and listening to each other so um, yeah hopefully have a good ride as a team here today as well. And I guess after all these national bees and that you'll be looking forward to getting abroad and yeah yeah I'm too <laughs> fair yeah um, yeah I think towards the end of April we've got um, yeah some U the UCI's I think uh, starting so uh, yeah I'm kind of raring to go for them because it's, it's really good racing that bees and gaining yeah. confidence in the hard races but also well, to, to get your hands myself. in there, to win races shows that you can win races. Exactly, yeah. And that's yeah. always a key target. Yeah, the, yeah, I think that was the, another big thing from the guys in the team saying you have to learn how to win races as well. If you can't win, then that be you're not going to win a UCI, are you? Know I mean? So it's, um, yeah, it's, it's about yeah, kind of gaining experience and testing the legs here and then, yeah, hopefully putting that to good use in the slightly bigger races in the coming months. So when you win a, a Nat B like the Wally Gemba, which has been around for years and years and years, like the Wadley and the mm. etc. Et um, do you find, do you still come out of there learning stuff? Yeah, definitely, definitely. I think, um, well, especially as that kind of, well, it was, you know, the nat, it was a Nat B, it was a hilly Nat B, so, but there's kind of a variation of terrain. So there's always lots of different things to learn. Yeah, I, was, I, was, I was reading what Alex Dowsett was saying, yeah. and he, he's still learning to win races yeah. here. <laughs> <laughs> well, definitely, I think, yeah, if, you always have to, win and learn and keep trying to improve don't you that's the that's that's the only way because if you don't then you aren't going to win the next one so yeah um hopefully back it up here um and yeah we'll see how it goes final word on this race top circuit it looks very tough yeah i haven't been around it but um yeah i know kind of again the winners from previous years and you know you've, it seems like a hard circuit one that could hopefully suit me and uh yeah, I had a kind of a look at it on the, the profile and that, and uh, yeah, it looks, looks hard, it looks very hard, so looking forward to getting... A good workout in. then. Yeah, <laughs> it should be. All right, well done.